Hello guys, welcome to Darts Tips with Rob. And obviously, you know, today we're gonna to work on trying to get the darts all together in the same bed. So, got one in one? No. So, concentrate on that one? No. So, three darts with each other should should go. Um, you know, say let's say, for argument's sake, you, you're trying to treble 12. You get the first one in the treble 12, and then the next one, should come in, providing your aiming, should come in and sit in the treble 12 with the next one. So, and, and the third one should do the same. You, you know, that's what we're aiming for, that's what we're gonna try and do. So, let's see how long it takes. Right, so that's in a single 20. Nope. You know, that, that was in, that was out, and that was in the one. So, you know, and, with, with the rules of darts, and the rules of practicing darts, I always advise that, you know, once you can get the darts grouped properly, which they're not, you, you know, and obviously once you've got that, then you can start working your way around the board, picking out numbers, you, you know, and, and trying to get the darts together. You know, the highest score on the board's obviously treble 20. Um, so, yeah, there you go, look. Two together, one not. So that's two in the same place. Now, providing I can bring that second one in, that's gonna give me a score of 60 points. And as you all know, if you consistently score 60 points in any match, it's not gonna take you long to get down to the finish. Um, and then the second part of the practice will be the finishes. You, you know, so that's kind of where you need to be trying to do. As you can see here, all three darts in the single 20 bed. So that's 60 points, which I'm happy with that. You, you know, um, always be happy with what you get because with darts, it's 80% muscle memory and 20% brain. And as long as you keep them figures in your, where, where you are, you know, and again, look, single, single, single. These two are close together, this one's a bit further up, but they're all in the 20 bed. You know, so that, that's, again, I'm happy with that. It's a good score. Ah, right, where do they go? Right, so, Right, one treble 20, single five, and a single 20. That's, that's a better score, because it's 85 points. But the thing is, I would have preferred it if the five had been in the 20 or the treble. You, you know, because then it's 140, or 100. So, you know, it's, it's all about thinking positive. And, and the other important thing is, you've got to play your own game. Don't worry about who you're playing. I've seen a lot of people stressing about who they're playing and, and, and what, what they're capable of doing and all this sort of stuff. And the moment you think about it, the moment your game's gonna fall apart. Right, there we go, look. So two in a treble 20 and one in a single 20. That's 140 points, which I'm impressed with. You, you know, I mean, it, it's not a matter of, oh, let's score 180 and, and all this sort of thing. You know, they are nice when you get them, as you all know, but they're not necessary. You know what I mean? I'd rather go through a game scoring a steady 100 points a leg. Uh, no, well, you know, that's in the one, that's in the 20, that's nowhere near these, these two darts. Um, you, you know, and, and this is the key thing with darts. If you think too much about the game, you would have lost. The trick is with darts, don't think about who you're playing. Don't think about the stress of the match coming up. Because the more you stress about it, you're not gonna be able to do anything about it. Again, this first one was in a treble, second one was in a five, third one was in a single. So again, 85 points, which I'm happy about, but the, the goal is to get the darts grouped together. Oh, 
Again, 60 points. These two were spot on. This is the first one I threw, and I was aiming for the flight of this one. And as you can see, they're all sort of together. They're not touching, um, but that's good enough because I now know that my dart circumference has gone from that to that to that to that. You, you know what I mean? Um, so obviously that's the goal. Oh, this one is it outside the, the double. That's outside the board and that's in the one. So I, I can't count those as close enough. You know, any dart that scores is close enough. That doesn't score. So I, I take that one away. You know what I mean? It's only scoring darts that matter. So the, the moment you're going for the doubles or, you, you know what I mean? It's, it's good providing the darts in the double. Oh. You know, again, two doubles and a single. So that's the second one I threw and that's the third one I threw. And all these dart flights are touching. I don't know if you can see that, but they're all touching. So that's brought my darts circumference down to about that. You, you know, and, and obviously, you know, we'd all like to get the darts circumference down to like an inch or half an inch or whatever it is. Um, and the, the realistic term is that the reason professionals are professionals is because they can do that. Um, hope you've had a good time, uh, enjoyed what you've seen. Don't forget to like, subscribe uh, for more content. Thank you very much.